Hi, my name's Maria Merry, and I recently bought a helicopter with my son Freddie and uh, we've turned it into a home cinema in our garage. So come and take a look. I decided to buy the helicopter following a visit to the museum in Western Supermare with my son Freddie in 2017 and we were exiting through the gift shop as you do and um, I know there were rubbers and magnets and things with helicopters printed on them and there's a picture of this helicopter so my son said can we have it and for a joke I said yes and we went and took a look at it out the back and um, I said we're having it so it was very impulsive. It took about four months in total to convert from a complete wreck into what it is now. Um, I had thought it would take a minimum of a year, so oh yeah, I was working every hour that is on this earth just to get it finished. I'd say the total cost of the project is about £10,000 and that includes the helicopter itself, um, all the labour and assistance that I was given, um, all the parts. So. Yeah, about ten thousand pounds. I renovated a lot of the helicopter myself uh, in conjunction with my friend, my good friend Josh Smith, who is a carpenter and general knows everything, um, self-taught on YouTube. So he's got a company called smith o -Matic, um, down in Chippenham, so his own workshop. And we, we just work together, so we're both learning throughout the whole process. And if there wasn't anything we knew, we would just go onto YouTube and think, all right, how do we do that? How do you rivet a helicopter screen into a helicopter? I mean, it's not something that you would really know. So it, we both learned a lot together doing that. The best part of the conversion for me is, well, it's just, it's just all of it, the, the mini bar under the bonnet. I just love that surprise when you open it and it's, that is a mini bar under there. It's really cool. Um, I've just been able to get the projector screen. I never thought the quality would be as good as it is and it is like a home cinema in here. It's just an amazing sound system. It's just fabulous. I love it. It's very luxurious. We're cruising at an altitude of 0,000 feet. People are blown away when they see it for the first time. They're not just impressed, they, they can't believe it. And a lot of the people that saw it when it was first delivered, and the state it was in, they were like, yeah, you, you, can't, you can't do anything with that. And I was like, yeah, okay. I didn't know what I was gonna be able to do, but I had a vision in my head. I'm quite creative, but I can never put that down on paper. It just, it just happens. And I've transformed it into this, and everyone is just blown away by it, and they love it. My best memory is Freddie's face when he saw it revealed for the first time. Uh, it was uh, just a couple of days before filming, it was a complete wreck and we hid it from Freddie, the final reveal. So when he got home from school, he walked in and he was absolutely blown away because he couldn't believe how it had been transformed. Even though he'd been working on it, just a couple of days before the reveal, it was, it was such a state. So just to then see it like this, uh, the look on his face made it all worth it. When I've got the doors open and people walk past, it is, it's fantastic to see them. I've had little children running in going, Mummy, Daddy, there's a, hel there's a helicopter, there's an aeroplane in that garage. And they run in and their parents are mortified that their kids have run into my garage. But I love it. It's so exciting. And I you know, let them come in and have a look. And people just stop in their tracks and say, is that a helicopter in a garage? And it's like, yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, come and have a look.